The city announcing fines and restitution settlements with two businesses today. Julian Cruz has that story. We will not tolerate this in the city of Chicago. People work too hard. Chicago Mayor Lori Lightfoot promising additional worker protections in the weeks ahead while celebrating a win at City Hall. Depriving a worker of paid sick leave is stealing hard-earned money. I mean, putting the worker, the business, and the community at risk. Chicago's Office of Labor Standards serving notice to those who violate the city's paid sick leave ordinance, cracking down on Mondelez International Chicago Bakery and the Downers Grove Holding Company operating local Burger Kings. In both of these cases we're announcing today, I'm proud to say we won restitution, nearly $1 million for thousands of workers. In the newly announced settlement, Tri-City Foods, which operates 40 Chicago Burger Kings, acknowledging they failed to grant paid sick leave to nearly 2,500 employees. Tri-City paying a $100,000 fine while agreeing to dole out restitution of more than $450,000 to longtime workers like Alba Roman. Fui obligada a trabajar en I was obligated to work while I was sick, Roman says, because I was not permitted to miss work. Also reaching settlement with the city, Mondelez International's bakery at 73rd and Kedzie, accused of failing to provide paid sick leave to 465 employees, agreeing to pay a fine of nearly $100,000 and nearly half a million dollars in restitution. Chicago's mayor pointing to studies that show a citywide problem when you consider all the companies who rely on low-wage workers. Julian Cruz reporting we reached out to both companies and heard back from Mondelez International. In a statement, they said, quote, we have cooperated fully with the city of Chicago during this process and moved immediately to make corrections following this settlement. We also appreciate the city's acknowledgement that we made a number of other paid sick leave entitlements during this period.